at every moment of our lives, we create an enormous amount of waste. The processing of this waste is a large expense and sometimes may cause harm to nature. With the land already filled to the limit, is there a way to effectively process the tons of toxic wastes that are daily being produced? The Guri Resources Retrieving Facility was created precisely to resolve this problem. A place to transform abandoned waste into valuable energy. Through what processes does the Guri Resources Retrieving Facility make these amazing works happen? In the early dawn, before people have begun to start their days, the waste that has been collected in Guri, Namyangju, and other neighboring areas steadily began to arrive at the Guri Resources Retrieving Facility. Guri made a regional agreement with Namyangju for the effective disposal of waste. Accordingly, Guri is responsible for the incineration of the waste discharge from both cities and Namyangju is responsible for burying the incineration remains in its landfills. The waste arrives and first, its weight is verified at the measurement station, then taken to the garbage bunker via a reception hall. This waste reception hall is installed with electric shutters and air curtains to block foul odors from leaking out. The waste undergoes a thorough mixing process with a large crane to ensure good combustion. Large, bulky wastes are broken down in a separate process, then put in a bunker. After the size and shape of the waste has been evenly distributed, it is placed in the incinerator and completely incinerated by the incredible heat of 900 degrees. A step-by-step -step High-tech system is in operation so as to prevent environmental pollution during the incineration process. Step 1. The most advanced computer systems are used to control the high temperatures, to complete combustion, and minimize the production of pollutants. Step 2. In the half-dry alkaline absorption tower, liquid calcium hydroxide is sprayed to remove the acidic gases. Step 3. In the sensor-activated filtration dust collector, filters are used to completely filter out dust and over 99.9% .9 of dioxins. Step 4. In the SCR catalyst tower, ammonia is sprayed to remove the nitrogen oxide. While going through this four-step process, dioxins, dust, sulfuric acid products, nitrogen oxide, and the like are cleanly removed and safely disposed. In particular, in the case of dioxins, we allow for less emissions than the set emission allowance standards in Germany, Japan, and other developed countries, strictly managed to give you peace of mind in your daily life. At the Guri Resources Retrieving Facility, there are no loud noises or foul odors as you might expect from an incinerating facility. The facility is operated according to strict balance calibrations, and the loud noises of the machine have been blocked, making it fairly quiet at all times. The noise is maintained at below the 45 decibels, which is about the same standard as an average residential area. In addition, the buildings are properly sealed according to their purpose, and because the air inside is pulled through ventilators to be incinerated, there is no need to be concerned about the leakage of foul odors. At the Goody Resources Retrieving Facility, all processes are thoroughly managed through a central control system. The entire facility operations are managed in the central control room. Here, you can understand precisely the complete operations, controls, and working status for effective management. If using high-tech systems to incinerate waste in an environmentally friendly manner was all that Guri Resources Retrieving Facility could accomplish, honestly, that would not be altogether very impressive. The really interesting story is just about to start. First, shall we explore the smokestack that comes to people's minds when they think of an incinerating facility? Guri's landmark that magnificent tower that everyone can see as they come and go from the city is actually the Guri Resources Retrieving Facility smokestack, Guri Tower. 
located near the Han River and the Acha Mountain, you can view the entire city from this observatory. A revolving restaurant with a great atmosphere for families and lovers to create fun and romantic memories. A gallery with art and photography exhibitions, as well as other colorful cultural festivals. All this can be found at Guri Tower. Another one of Guri Resources retrieving facilities hidden secrets is that the residual energy generated from the incineration is used. Here, a swimming pool, soccer field, pusa field, walking trails, and various other facilities are available for the convenience of city residents. In particular, even in the winter, not one drop of oil is used to operate the swimming pool and the sauna because they are heated and cooled with residual energy generated from the waste incineration process, supporting local residents with services at cost-effective prices. The soccer field covered with lovely artificial grass is a popular facility that is enjoyed by residents all 365 days of the year. In addition, lighted facilities allow for nighttime exercise and there is a steady stream of visitors late into the evening. Also, based in the sports facility annex, our children's sports team administration, yoga, aerobics, ballet, and various other programs. We operate an affordable and convenient facility for all residents to enjoy and guide them towards healthy lifestyles. This sanctuary for raising the next elite sports stars, together with the united support of community residents, is gaining a rising reputation. For the residents of the regions, this is a place that uses personal experience to learn about environmental freshness, the recyclable sorting facility. Here, by separating the recyclable waste into categories by type, they are renewed as valuable resources. If residents throw away waste without much regard, it simply becomes trash. But here, they experience firsthand and realize that if you recollect, these things can actually become resources. Guri Resources Retrieving Facility achieves incredible energy savings of about 700 million Korean won annually. Visitors from Korea and abroad, approximately 100,000 per year, come to learn about the remarkable achievements of this place. However, even more important than these statistics is the fact that a waste incineration facility, which everyone wanted to avoid, has now become a facility that residents of this region have come to love as a highly valued facility. From a target of opposition and protest, it has now changed into a facility that everyone wants in their neighborhood. This place has shed the stigma of a waste incineration facility and has begun to transition to what it hopes to be better known as a resource retrieving facility. The Guri Resource Collection Facility was created with concern for the environment, advanced scientific systems, and the trust of the people. The future synergy achievements of the Guri Resource Collection Facility will be as boundless as the energy that is renewed in this place. <laughs>